Hi, I'm Russ Weninger. I'm an immigration lawyer practicing in Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to tell you the first thing you must do if you want to sponsor your parents or grandparents for permanent residence. Immigration Refugees and Citizenship Canada randomly selects interested sponsors and sends them notices that they have been selected to sponsor their parents and that they must submit complete parent sponsorship applications by particular deadlines. In order to have a chance of being selected by IRCC, you must first enter a lottery by completing an interest to sponsor web form. I'll leave a link to the lottery web form in the video description. This year, people can enter the lottery throughout January and the lottery will close on the first day of February. It doesn't cost anything to enter the lottery. However, if you are selected and decide to submit a parent sponsorship application, then you will have to pay the application fees for the actual sponsorship application. It's quite easy to enter the lottery. All you have to do is enter a bit of information about yourself, the size of your family, and your parents. You also have to indicate if you are likely to meet the income requirements to sponsor your parents. Information about the income requirements is also included on the web form. Being selected and submitting an application does not guarantee success. If your application is incomplete, or if you don't qualify as a sponsor, your application could be rejected. A person may fail to qualify as a sponsor if they do not, in fact, meet the income requirements for parental sponsorship. In the past, the Canadian government accepted sponsorship applications on a first-come, first-served basis. However, the government would only accept a certain number of applications a year. Currently, the government is accepting 10,000 parent sponsorship applications a year. The number of people interested in sponsoring their parents far exceeds the number of applications the government is willing to accept. Last year, close to 100,000 people entered the sponsorship lottery. Please check out my upcoming video in which I will talk about the income requirements for parent sponsorship. If you enjoyed this video, please feel free to like it or share it or subscribe to my channel. If you have a question, please leave it in the comment section and I will do my best to respond. While I don't want to give specific legal advice in the comment section, I will try my best to answer general questions provided it is understood that my responses to comments should not be taken as legal advice, that social media interactions are not considered lawyer-client interactions, and that your safest course of action is to consult directly with me or another immigration lawyer if you have an immigration issue.